Hey, what's up guys? It's Brennan here with Ballast Home Flipping. I got another Squid Trainer V3.5 here. And in my opinion, I think this is the best performing trainer when it comes to just strictly performance. Because I've just felt, um, in comparison to a lot of Ballast Homes that I've owned, that this takes the least amount of work to get what you need done. It's got great um, weight and balance. And... Uh, yeah, so anyway, I wanted to pair up my highest uh, performance Balasong, in my opinion, against my favorite Balasong. Um, because I've said that there has been a lot of differences between favorite versus performance, and I haven't actually directly ever compared um, a BB Barfly to a squid trainer so this will be the first time i do it and i'll be letting you guys know whether my favorite is actually as good or better in terms of performance against the squid trainer and uh also if i still think the squid trainer is on top in terms of performance out of uh, what i favorite so this is going to be a very difficult one but um yeah i'm basically going to pause the video now Go back and forth between flipping these two because I just got this squid trainer. And then I will come back and let you guys know the verdict. Alright guys, I am back. I've been out here for a little while. And uh, I went back and forth between these two. And I've gotten a very, very good um, representation of how these both flip now. Um, and so I wanted to mention that <clears throat> these... Uh, both of these flippers are very, very, very similar in terms of performance. I'm talking about the weight and everything. Um, the only difference being that the Firefly has thicker handles. And so because of that, um, during some of the fans and some of the transitions, it is a tiny bit wonkier. Now, do not hear me say that and then think, oh, this is bad now for some strange reason. I love I love this um, Balasong, and I think that this flips exactly like that one. The only difference being is that these handles are thicker, so I'm just mentioning that it feels a little bit more wobbly during flipping, but this has bushings, and the Squid Trainer doesn't. So, yeah, there's another thing to factor in there. But yeah, if uh, I'm going, when I was going back in between these two, I was pretty much thinking, wow, these really are, you know, around the same price and uh, pretty much around the same performance. But in the in the uh, grand scheme of things, I figured out that the Squid Trainer is still on top in terms of uh, performance, just because the handles are slightly thinner, just making it easier to control. Um, and yeah. So Squid Trainer is still on top, in my opinion, out of all of the trainers I flip, Squid Trainer is still on top. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, I'll be coming out with another video very soon for you guys to enjoy. So, yeet. Yeah.